Greetings fellow Oscar Avengers, welcome back to Oscar's weekly challenge for week 28 of 2020. I think this is gonna be the last episode because we're only down to two tier leaks left now and I basically just do not want to go back to the previous ones because I pretty much sold all my stuff. Um, technically I could go back to Century uh, start, uh, system to sell myself more uh, jump fuels but uh, since I only have one jump fuel, I don't think I'm gonna need it as much unless uh, some of this last fuel depots will grant me two of each fuels, uh, jump fuels, that will be an extra uh, point for me there. Hmm. Okay, no trap. I'm just gonna equip myself the turret. And if there are slimes, I can just uh, draft them uh, thanks to shield. Mm, yeah, I still need the pry, and um, I think I'm just gonna use the transporter and the last uh, derelict. And I'm not gonna use any of the uh, ship upgrades just because I'm silly like that. Uh, besides, this is also the one with the unknown amount of infestation type, so it's gonna be a little bit tricky to get that one done uh, uh, quick. Of course, it depends on the amount of infestation types later on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll set basically. Hold on. Okay, I, s I got all my scraps added to my drones. That's nice. Alright, there's indeed a Dormant drone in room 2 that I'm gonna miss, unfortunately. And there are two of them even! Holy crap! Yeah, I'm gonna miss that. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of a given at this point, uh, given that I really am committed not to change my drones and such. But uh, I definitely have lost 21 scraps so far uh, when converting each of the uh, drones into scraps, basically. Alright, I'm gonna start at 220. Oh, swarm, huh? Interesting. This one has to teleport, and then... That one has generator and shield. Which means I'm gonna just uh, put my cockpits there, and... Yeah. Here and then here. Nice. So room 11 is the one with the swarm. Wait, or is it this room? Oh yeah, definitely the top one. Oh!
Hmm. All right. Uh... Hmm. I think look just actually lost uh, his friend's bar. Look just actually lost his uh, dream view in a second there, just at the sterling, I believe. The next generator is in A11. Hmm. I know how to deal with that uh, swarm located at room 11. Room 11, A11. What's the difference? What the heck? Why are there so many sounds? Okay, um... Alright. Why does that sound like there are two swarms there? I'm not sure. I'm not sure, Chief. Okay, this is not the fen, fen room. Oops. Yeah, basically if you change your semantic view in the middle of a uh, boarding craft redocking, you can see your drill like that. Like this basically. It's kinda silly, but it worked. Alright, so glass room at A8. Which apparently has the swarm. All right, I'm just, I'm just gonna move you to room 16 and thank you to death. I'm just gonna wait. Instead of redocking to A11, I'm just gonna do that, and uh, yeah, I'm just not gonna bother to collect all the drones there, I'm just gonna get out now. See ya swarms, not gonna miss you big time. Scan the terrorists, but thankfully probe. Exactly. So extra generator, uh, I still need the, the tow and the pry, and wait a second, yeah the teleport, I don't need to teleport actually, uh, what do you think about it? Mm, I'm just gonna convert this into scrap, that, and then... I don't think I'm gonna use this much. There you have it. Alright. Alright. Okay, teleport's gotta go because I prefer to get myself for empty slots basically. Um yeah, that's basically it. 
and then we're gonna go to Osiris mm -hmm. and yeah. oh yeah we're gonna equip transporter and we're gonna definitely uh, give this to a very good advantage and let's go hold on actually I'm just gonna uh, Waste more to Ian. There you go. All right. So inconclusive, unknown model infestation types, made him whole integrity. All right. Ah. Room two is exactly there. All right. I'm just gonna start at eleven thirty-five. And got ourselves greeted immediately with the drone that we will never gonna collect. And wow, this is a big fuel depot. B, holy hell! That's extra turret though. Not much of a disappoint disappointment at least. And of course, another extra drone with the gather. Gonna need this gather right here. Um, just for the sake of uh, extra points for drone upgrade, drone upgrades to collect. Apparently, fuel depot has really has more than one drone. Oh, how I have underestimated uh, the situation. Uh, not scan. I've been getting too used to use scan. Then I forgot how to uh, launch my probe. I still don't forget how to use the stealth at least. Hmm. Awesome. Hmm. Okay, that room three doesn't have. Unlock. Hmm. So that's pretty much uh, 35 scraps uh, to the drain because I already lost uh, 5 disabled drones. <laughs> uh, times 7 with 5 basically, and you get 35. Math at best. No slime yet. Hmm. I'm gonna deal with that uh, leaper and the generator much later. Still have a lot of rooms to explore around here at least. Oh my god! Stuff, all right. That's room seven, all right. Whew. Can I? 
kind of have a strong feeling that we really only have Leaper for our investigation type here. Yeah, that's another one. Oh, sorry. In a way, bliss probe really. All right, we're done with that one. Most of these transport signals are in the rooms that I have visited, except room twelve. It's gonna be quite tricky to deal with that. Oh, room 13 then. Yeah, no slime. Ah, fingers ish. I can still go to D34 if this sleeper decided to move uh, to my position. In which I do hope that you're gonna move soon, and thankfully you are. Kinda scares you with it decides to jump on the But as long as your drone is not in the doorway, it won't decide to move suddenly to your position that is your room eight in this case. Uh, yeah, I think 
we really only have leapers, yeah. Oh, I have gone here, I didn't realize. I'm just gonna unstuck myself. Yeah, I think after three leapers and majority of these rooms are all empty, I'm pretty positive that we only have leaper for our investigation type. Still no slime spawn. I'm looking at the new slime spawn. Yeah. Yeah, the fan is not even spawning in something. D28 to our cinematic view, shall we? And one more room left. Room 13 doesn't have the one with. What is it? Airlock? So we're gonna try to visit that manually. You're almost done though. Leaper here, right? Done. Not gonna bother myself to uh, find that leaper at room 14. Not gonna bother to collect all these uh, disabled drones, unfortunately. 35 points have been down to train. It's out actually. What? Oh, right, because uh, this drone is still in the room with the transport signal. We'll try or not have that, thank you so much. Or maybe I'm just gonna wait until the transporter at room 2 is lost. What's the percentage of my token? 12%? You know what. with no damage oh, an entire weekly run without damage my god who would have thought to be able to pull such a thing right yep the total deteriorates by six percent pretty big on its own i'd say but we got it done regardless i'm not gonna bother to really visit uh any more auto traits since we don't really have uh, anything much uh, to trade with like a red upgrade or something and now we're gonna convert all these upgrades into scraps and then put it in our drones because we are rich like that Man, I should have uh, experimented with the Leaper about uh, their 
movements with shield, but I forgot to do that. Oh well, oh well, oh well, oh well. I was I was actually looking forward to that, but then I forgot. Good job, me. Oh yeah, yeah, right, right, right. Have to make sure that you don't convert all your upgrades into a scrap in one. No, I don't want to repair that. Clear. Wow, it's late. I think that's why I tend to misclick and not to talk much. But then it's still 10:40 p.m. I'm not supposed to be this uh, tired. <laughs> 22 28 on the dot Very nice At maximum you can do something with uh, Six of your drone upgrades you do not want to add more basically or else it's not gonna get registered to your scrap edition i had that uh pretty roughly on my previous weekly and i had to take it unfortunately one of those uh Pretty much the disadvantaging side on uh, commandering a private PV tend to have this uh, pretty low scrap capacity. That's 27, isn't it? Okay, that's close. All right. Hoo -hoo. Good. One more. Okay. 26. Do not want to add more. Increase. Nice. Nice. Um, ship upgrades. Four ship upgrades first before continuing on converting them into scraps. Three, four, five, four, eighty. Okay. One, two, five hundred uh, on the dot. This convert it into scraps, and we should be done. I'm just gonna convert it into look side for being a good generator drone as look was. And we're just gonna be out with this thing. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. And be sure to immediately jump to the target and not do anything else. Like, uh, for example, if you want to look at the galaxy, don't. You better do that before you jump into the target or else things can be buggy regardless and such and such. We are definitely went all zero for the scrap to uh, upgrade ourselves this drone HP because holy crap, look at that. Whoa, what the hell, that kind of thing. In a way, uh, some people mentioned that uh, the game should have uh, rewarded you for clearing out ships or even commandeering them and then uh, added, add that kind of factor into the score which I actually see it as a sensible uh, kind of a challenge thing in which, yeah, I guess the dev should have done it as well but uh, unfortunately, people consider this game as finished despite a couple of bugs to be found and uh, mainly the, uh, the campaign or the weekly one that uh, some people can see it as the buggiest of all uh, we're just gonna hit ok here target really adds your point by 1000 and it's pretty much worth it on its own and I definitely hit it to the top uh, pretty much beating Demoness which is still currently playing it seems kick and quasi demo uh, good job forks for beating the 10k score there 
Um, with that being said, item is gonna be off. Mm, I'm not sure what else that I can say. Uh, um, strategy wise, but uh, yeah, for the leaper, you really gotta be careful with them. Especially in my experience, to check them via vertical airlocks or doors, or else uh, they will just eventually suddenly just leap at you. Uh, all of a sudden. And be sure to do that uh, not in an extremely uh, thin room basically, like a very long room or the very tall room basically because uh, except if you did that in the room that is pretty much adjacent uh, um, with the door pretty much very uh, close to the center of the room. I think you can pretty much try to excuse that, but uh, make sure to add your quick close all allies like uh, CC, like I tend to do in that daily and weekly in general. So, yeah. Uh, overall, uh, I hope this weekly has been pretty helpful. I hope. Not gonna hope much, but I hope it does in a sense. I don't know what else to say, but thank you so much for watching. I think it's gonna be my weekly video for uh, for a while. I'm just gonna upload this pretty much um, sporadically. Pretty much um, starting from uh, daily 18th of July of 2020, which means pretty much uh, gonna be tomorrow. Um, when this daily resets and then 12 hours uh after that daily resets to give my uh daily video a little bit of uh shine before i eventually uh move to uploading my weekly channel so yeah um and then i after that i really definitely have to go back to play past it jesus christ uh regardless thanks you all for watching my shoulders hurting holy crap but uh it was worth uh doing the doing this again once in a while Cheers guys, have a good day.